This is Mission Control Houston. Uh, you're continuing to uh, take a look at particles leaking from the uh, Soyuz MS-22 spacecraft docked to the Rosviet module of the International Space Station. This leak uh, was first observed about uh, two hours and 45 minutes ago, around 6.45 p.m. Central Time, at the time at which Sergei Prokopiev and Dmitry Patelin were uh, preparing uh, to begin a spacewalk to uh, move uh, outside of the Poisk airlock of the station, a spacewalk designed uh, to move a radiator from the Rosviet module to the Naoka multipurpose laboratory module. This leak or stream of particles from the area of the instrumentation and propulsion module was associated with uh, a uh, drop in pressure in the cooling loop of the Soyuz MS-22. It is not known uh, what the source of the leak is. Russian specialists are in the process of evaluating uh, data, taking a careful look at uh, video that is being sent to them from here in Mission Control. While we stand by and uh, wait for further word, in the meantime, Prokopiev and Patelin safely back inside the International Space Station. They were never in any danger in the airlock, in the Poisk airlock uh, of the station, preparing for their spacewalk. They're now out of their Orlon spacesuits, awaiting further word on uh, what the next course of action will be. This is the Soyuz vehicle that was launched back in September to carry Prokopiev, the Soyuz commander, and now Expedition 68 commander, Patelin and NASA's Frank Rubio to the station, launching from the Baikonur Cosmodrome in Kazakhstan. Station, space to ground one. Fort Mitri. Go ahead on space to ground two. I opened Fort One Two One. And so I'm supposed to do a suit activation and the pressure sensors test. So steps 2, 4, and 6 to 11 have to be completed. Copy that. Steps 2, 4, and 6 through 11. And Mitri, the pressure sensors should be in uh, at 690.
This is Mission Control Houston. Uh, once again, uh, it has been uh, just about uh, three hours now since we first observed uh, what you're seeing on the screen, that being uh, a leak of uh, particles, presumably from a cooling loop on the uh, Soyuz MS-22 at the Rosviet module of the International Space Station that forced a cancellation of tonight's spacewalk by uh, Sergei Prokopiev and Dmitry Patelin.